Hello and welcome to a very, very special edition of Sent You a Message. We've got Chet Falazek uh, from Valve, writer on Left 4 Dead 2, and he's going to be answering all the queries that you've sent in to our Twitter account. So, uh, Chet, thanks very much for joining us. And to kick things off, we've got a bit of a skeptic. Uh, Jigger J says he's still not sold by Left 4 Dead 2, so what's so new about it that, that he should be kind of trading in his Left 4 Dead 1? Uh, so we we'll, we'll can start with there's three new specials, all playable in Versus and the new game mode that uh, we'll be talking about next month. Uh, we've got four new characters, we've got five new campaigns, uh, we've got Versus Survival Co-op and the new game mode in every single campaign. We've got melee weapons, we've got all new brand weapons. We have uh, things like the upgraded weapon or upgraded ammo, incendiary ammo, explosive ammo. We've got the things like the laser sight edition. We have some other stuff that we haven't quite. Uh, released yet out on that. It's just a huge, giant, big game. And the cool thing is, we'll have a demo out before it comes out, so uh, I just play it, check out the demo, see what you think. Um, next up we have Siphon222, who wants to know if there's going to be a limited edition of Left 4 Dead 2. Uh, we tend not to do limited editions. There won't be a limited edition version of uh, Left 4 Dead, um, but, you know, the full version's got everything in it that we wanted to have in the game. Uh, you know, if you want, go to your local hardware store, pick up your own little mask, write Left 4 Dead in the front, walk around. Feel free. No. Uh, next up, we have Lazarus Cypher, who uh, is a bit of a chef and wants to know how awesome the frying pan will be against the undead hordes. The uh, frying pan is insanely awesome. As I just demonstrated seconds ago here, uh, where I showed my ring or played my ringtone, which is the frying pan. Uh, it makes a very satisfying noise when you slug a zombie and it sends them flying. So, and, it's not, it, and to be clear. If you go home and you just pick up your random frying pan, that's not it, right? It's cast iron skillet. If you carry that thing around, you're going to bulging Popeye arms because it's heavy. It's like 20 pounds of just metal you're hitting them with. And it makes a fantastic ringtone, everyone at home. I can confirm this. Okay, Phil Switch asked the next question, and he's a big fan of the witches and tanks, and wants to know if they're still going to be appearing in Left 4 Dead 2. Sure. Um, and one of the other... Oh, how about just yes? Yes, they are. Um, so, also, uh, though, so... Uh, one of the cool things we have, we have with Daylight, because um, some of the maps are in Daylight, not all of them, just some of them, uh, the witch actually wanders around now. And uh, it's funny watching experienced players uh, who are very much used to hearing witch noise, looking down at the ground, not thinking, oh, that zombie's up there is walking, I can shoot her. Where once you start to realize that that's a possibility, then you have to change your play style a little bit. So it's fun. Cool. And he also is keen to know about the new special infected uh, that you spoke about earlier, the three new types. Well, uh, so we have the spitter. First of all, we'll go on her. Uh, it's a female spitting zombie that spits this aerial denial attack. It's great for flushing people out. The longer you stay in it, the more damage you take exponentially. So it's one of those, if you spits and you just run out of it, it it's easy to get out of. But if you just decide, oh, no, I'm going to hold it out, it's just going to drop you. You'll be incapped. Uh, we have the charger. So for those teams that were really tightly bunched and impossible to get through in versus, they're now easy to get because you just pop, you grab the first one, you take them and then just slam them through the rest of them and then send them all flying. And then the jockey, so the last one we've recently uh, announced. And the jockey, you, you jump on somebody and you ride them like a horse, kind of. Yes, well, kind of. All right, you ride them. Let's just say that. And uh, and so you fight for steering control and uh, like the AI jockey will purposely try to take you. If the spitter will spit, the jockey will take you over the spits and take damage. That can take you off ledges, take you back to the beginning of the map. Uh, it'll always try to fight to put something between uh, the other survivors and the one he's jockeying so that they can't shoot him off. Um, and they all work together uh, really well, and they're all playable in Versus and the new game mode. Um, I suppose on that note, then, uh, push that button already has a favor uh, and says, isn't the boomer adorable? Really? Different strokes. Do you not really? agree? There's, there's probably websites for that, but... Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I, 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 I would not describe the boomer as adorable, even though doing the little sumo thing while you're hanging out with your friends on top of a roof or whatever is kind of fun. I, I, I wouldn't describe the, the boomer <laughs> as adorable. And uh, finally, um, Braggy uh, says, do you have a message for all of the uh, Left 4 Dead 2 boycotting communities to win them over? Um, you know, our, our idea has always been from the beginning is we're going to keep updating Left 4 Dead 1. Um, so we've got Crash Course DLC coming out um, very, very soon. But uh, So, you know, we, we were updating there. Um, we've got the demo coming out before the game comes out. We've been showing the game. Uh, we're confident that once people see everything, you know, it'll be fine. Cool. Uh, on that note, can you elaborate a bit more about the, um, the Crash Course DLC that you mentioned there? So Crash Course DLC is a two-map campaign. Uh, we wanted to make this little shorter experience about Versus. Um, we've added some of the stuff. 
You'll see them updated to like a recharge timer for your teammates so that you know when you're you know if you play versus you're yelling at your friend, boomer on them, boomer on them. Well, they can't. They're recharging, right? So now you can see that and still yell at them, but at least you know they actually can. Um, and so uh, that'll be coming out the 22nd. It's got survival. It's got the verses. Um, we went back with the cast and re-recorded a whole bunch of new stuff. Um, we've got Francis hating a bunch of stuff. Actually, loves something maybe. Um, you know, and so it, it was great fun going back with them and going through that. So it, uh, hopefully, people just love it. Fantastic, Chet. Thank you very much for taking the time to talk to us. Can't wait for the game. Thank you very much for your questions, and keep the questions coming in to the Gamer Tag. Send your message. Send your message at hotmail.com, or you can at us at Twitter at Send Your Message. We'll see you next time.